Can you introduce yourself, who you are, and what you do? Yeah, I'm Mina. I'm a yoga teacher virtually and in Minneapolis. Okay, and what does gratitude mean to you? Um, gratitude to me, I think one of my favorite definitions is gratitude is love and hope and action. And it's not just a word, but it's a verb. Um, so for me, it's a way of life. Um, and it's a way to live in a really deliberate way, being very cognizant of the energy you bring in and the energy you send out. Um, yeah, so that's gratitude for me. Can we actually go over here? <laughs> so we can you reduce a little bit of the background noise? Okay. Um, who and what are you grateful for? Um, who am I grateful When I think of who I'm grateful for right away, I'm really grateful for my family. Um, I'm really close with my family. And one of my brothers in particular, um, he was diagnosed with a really advanced stage of cancer like four years ago. And he chose gratitude. And it was a really controversial decision. Um, to be hopeful and grateful in a really intense situation. And so when I think of gratitude and who I'm grateful for, I'm really grateful for his example in my life of choosing to be grateful in a shitty situation because it's the one thing we can control is our mindset. Um, so that's what I think of. Um, how do you express gratitude? Um, how do I express gratitude? I think just every day waking up and choosing to be hopeful and grateful and also showing people that you love them. I think that's the biggest thing for me is I'm a really big, um, like I love quality time, right? When we think about like different, your different love languages, so spending time with loved ones and giving people their flowers now and spending time with them, that's how I show people gratitude. How do you like gratitude to be expressed to you? Oh man, it is all quality time for me. Just like the best thing in the world is being able to spend time with my friends and family. Um, so that is how I think it's expressed to me. Awesome, thank you. Yeah.